We are at the Basilica of St. Peter. This is a dome. And you can see the letters. It's nearly like it measures like six feet and yeah, nine feet, somehow like this. One and a half for a man's height. And this is the Baldocchino, the main altar, wherein this Baldocchino was being transferred from the church of the Pantheon and a really original bronze and it is like 2,000 years old and it seems so little but really really high once someone is cleaning on this they really need a crane huh. this is the main altar it's being used usually every Sunday and yeah the famous image statue of St. Helen and yeah, on the other side you can see Veronica there it's Veronica and here is St. Andrew there and yeah St. Saint, Saint Longinus the one who pierced the heart of our Lord and the cross yeah this is the side altar and another one here straight it's the main door there and yeah this is the chapel of Saint Joseph over there where ha. Carmen and I made a promise to Saint Joseph there one of the most promising chapel and remember and memorable chapel ever in my life here is down below it's the tomb of St. Peter there down and yeah there I can go down St. Peter yeah. so much so much stories yeah you can see that for evangelist and uh, yeah, Tom of St. Peter. Down. Uh, yeah. It's wide and huge, really, very big. You can see this? Yeah. Tourists falling in line to touch the feet of Saint Peter. And look, this is the famous Saint Peter image of Saint Peter. And the tourist is touching the feet of, of him. And mostly these people really fall in line to touch this image. And look, the image is a bit decapitated and melted because of thousands and hundreds of pilgrims see so, a lot of tourists so much of tourists really shall we go to the tomb of Saint Pius the tent actually the place where where it's the catacomb is down there. I guess we can get down. We still have time. Let's see. Let's get down. It's still open. So, ha. Huh. That chapel there. It's a chapel of Saint Joseph. And ha, huh, carbon. I remember us here. Anyway. And that is the sacristy where priests prepare themselves for the Mass. And yeah, that's it. And yeah, let's go down. Down is where the catacombs of the popes is being buried. And here, yeah, a very little staircase. And yeah, we are down. 
symbol of the grapes. Some of the popes is buried there, and one of them is Pius the Twelve. He's buried there. He's my favorite pope, or is the holy one who made the, who declared the dogma of the Assumption. Okay. And yeah, here is famous catacomb side altars to the popes. Here. Yeah, Pope Spirit here. Mm. Yeah, and this is the sepulchrum. The sepulchre, Saint Peter. Look. And there is the stairs. Goes to the main altar above. Right. Right. Okay. Mm. Walk, 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 walk. Yeah, another side altar here. And yeah. Here is another tombs of yeah, the Pope here. The road. In a chained shoes, the night. And look who's buried here. He spoke Johannes Paulus II. Mm. Yeah. Johannes Paulus the first, I guess. Paulus the sixth. And yeah. Look at it. And you should know these saints here. San Pedro Calus. A Filipino saint. And the smooth. Another here. So many. There. Okay. Another one here. Oops, the eight there. So shall we move back? Going back, on that side here is the saints or tomb of the popes here. Okay. Johannes Paulus the first there. Uh, um, I don't know is this pope here. This. I would like to go to Pius the Twelfth, really. Signore, per così mi ha io entrare con Ah, yes. 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 Going back to the main altar here. There. The Balutkin. Okay. And there's a tomb there. It's quite a big cathedral. <laughs> Not cathedral, basilica. Sorry. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. Look at the floor. There. Right. Shall we go to the tomb of St. Pius the Tenth? 
there's also the least of uh, popes here and just get get inside the, the sacristy just a bit okay mm, look wow sit down there this is saint peter and this is the list of the popes look. from saint peter down 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 up here pope Chempel the second is there 2005 okay then let's go back Let's go back. I'm touring you guys with the Basilica of St. Peter. Mm. Look at the floor, so nice. Pontimex. Clemens so big huh? there is another Pope who lay down here let's see what's the name of the Pope there should be a name somewhere yeah yeah he's Innocentus Pontimax 11 he's made of wax but it's not incorruptible so much. Okay. We are walking at the side altar. This is only just the side altar. Mm, yeah. One of the popes is, is buried here. And this is Innocentio. Innocence 11. Innocence 11. And Leo the 11. Leo 11 was buried here. Excuse me. Yeah. And yeah. So big. Really. So big. And yeah, this is one of my favorite chapels. The Chapel of Our Lady of Assumption. So beautiful chapel. Lady of Assumption. Usually they're having um, the baptized children here. So nice. It's a nice altar. And yeah, I'm walking towards the encrypt body of St. Pius the Tenth. I always visited him here also yeah then there he is um, it's a bit in the distance because we're not allowed to get in yeah St. Pius the thing there he's incorruptible and Benedict the fifteenth lay down here. See? Mm. Yeah. Walking cross cross the basilica. And yeah, the La Pieta, I would like to, to show it to you, the Pieta. The question is why there is this a little bit of barricade line here. This is to note that the line of the churches around the world measures how big and great is the basilica. Look, for example, the biggest and the biggest churches in the world is Londinense, oh, San Paolo, San Paolo, yeah, and yeah, I can see it. Well, that's the biggest church in the world and I don't know how it measures it measures like 
158.10 meters from the altar okay so from the first row there is the Basilica of Sydney Sydney and got down here is the Basilica of St. Paul in London so it's 400 meters from the altar there up to the main door it's 400 meters so this is the biggest Whoa. Ah, you can see this, the famous saint, you should know her, mm, Teresa of Avila and Saint John of the Cross, right, so big, and yeah, we're walking towards the La Pieta that is made by Michelangelo. And this La Pieta is being made. Um, this is the main altar. Um, in La, this La Pieta was being made when Mike Michelangelo is just 25 years old and no one believed him because it's so fine that the effect, I mean the the product of his work is so refined and so nice and so unbelievable that uh, the Pope could not believe that he made this one. So this one is the third uh, material, finished material that he made. The first one was being refused by the church and then the first one was in Milan, the second one is in Florence and then this is the third one he made. And he was 25 years old so in order that the Pope would believe him that he made it on the strap of Our Lady he put inscribed the name of Michelangelo ha. so they believe him and then he put it here at the main altar and one of the most visited chapel also inside the Basilica so now yeah I'm walking towards the, the tomb of Pope John Paul II. Look, uh, that's the tomb. His tomb, Johannes Paulus Segundus. Okay, let's go and walk. Walk and walk, walk. Going to the sacristy. No, um, to the side where there is a confessional, we like to go for an English priest. Usually, they have confession at starting like four o'clock in the afternoon. It will finish seven. Look at the child there. Hmm. See how big it is really big and up there above the letters you can see the letters Celorum et tu Petrus tu es Petrus is mosaic the wall is made of mosaic and above the dome you can go up to the copula yeah going inside I guess and I hope I could get in but I guess it's gone. Excuse me, no confession. 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 This way. So. Let's see. There go. Our lady there. It's beautiful. Grig Gregorio, 16, buried there. And yeah. This is a confessionals, 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 and confessionals. Look at its state there Italian and English. And there and there. And yeah, 
ghost down here. Benedicto the sixteenth was buried there. Sixteenth Benedict the no no sorry Benedict the fourteenth. Yeah, the people is there. I'm back. It's confessional there. Confessional, confessional. And there. It's the Baldacino again, so I'm back. Wow. I love Rome and I love the Basilica, one of the beautiful basilica in the world. We should pray for our church and the word of Basilica. Thanks. Yeah.